Welcome back to Let's Play Dot Hack GU. We're off to Lumina Cloth, where we already happen to be, because I totally just warped in here. But our first match in the arena has been scheduled, so we're here to participate. Yeah, yeah, I already saved. It's almost time for our first match. Oh man, I'm getting kind of nervous. The weight is killing me. How about you, Haseo? Are you okay? Nervous or anything? Hey, fighting in the arena is exactly the same as hunting monsters, you know. No different. But with all of the people around watching you, it does make for a lot of pressure. Long ago, when I just started, I tried participating in the arena. I was so nervous, I couldn't do anything. And we ended up getting beaten really badly. Yeah, it's oh, yeah, I remember that. You okay with this, Atali? <sighs> hey, Atali. Huh? What is it? Is something wrong? She's pretty nervous. You will. By the way. Huh? What should I do out there? <sighs> <sighs> well, why don't you focus on healing skills? Okay, understood. I I hope we'll be okay. Well, let's go and find out. Through tenacity and willpower alone, we'll come out of this victorious. Now while you're in here, this is the waiting room before a match, you can go over to this one, this big screen looking thing, and see what our opponents will be. And considering they're all level 10, and we're level 17, 18, I get the feeling we're gonna breeze through this pretty easy. And then you can see the overall ranking over here. Since we are very newly registered, we're currently rank 500 with zero WP. We're at the bottom. As we defeat people, we will get more WP and slowly raise in the ranks. The goal is to get ourselves in the top 16 here. If we get in the top 16, the actual tournament begins the pre with the preliminaries long past. So let's go ahead and go off to uh, fighting a dude. Now retire is kind of if you decide you don't want to, you can leave, but uh, start battle. Now is the time for the festivities to begin. You calling us low-ranking cubs? Hey, more like a sleeping lion hungry for its first kill. Let your beastly instincts run wild! Fight's dirty, nice compliment! While they're asleep, or while they're awake, they think of nothing other than the slaughter! This is their paradise! Just look at them, folks! Ready to rip the opponent in half! How will this fight end? The battle only kind of begins. This is, um... This fight is actually a lot different from a regular battle. As they mentioned here, if you defeat the leader of the opposing team, you win immediately. You cannot, however, use items at all. HP restored by healing spells is halved, and we are able to counterattack, which Syllabus will explain here shortly. Arena battles are basically the same as the regular battles we're always used to fighting. In fact, um, Syllabus was asking if Haseo was nervous, and... Well, Haseo is the PKK, the Terror of Death. I think he's used to fighting other people. So, I don't think he's... <laughs> I think he's ready. 
The main thing that's different this time is that we're fighting against other players. Haseo never did really participate in the arena, though, since, well, he didn't really care for, care for sanctioned things. He was after the PKs. So, I'll, some of this is going to be new to him. And we can get hit with a Rengeki attack as well. Yeah, we're playing other players, so they can do the same things we can. They can Rengeki us, they can use an Awakening on us, and they can counterattack us, which we'll get to the counterattack. The most important thing in the arena is a counter strategy to our opponent's Rengeki attacks. Oh, look, Haseo! The enemy's trying to use arts! Best thing is to use the counterattack! If you use a skill trigger attack on an enemy while they're in this state, you can activate a counterattack. Not only will a counterattack completely guard against an enemy's arts, but it will also deal them counter damage. Darn straight. And on top of that, it'll even lower their morale gauge. You can defend against your opponent's awakening even before they activate it. In other words, the more I use them, the better things will be for us. And that's it. Oh, but... Our opponents can also use counterattacks, so be really careful when using the skill trigger. Don't just abuse it. Okay, then let's give it a shot. Press the R1 button to activate the counterattack. Go! Good! I knew someone battle-hardened like you could do it. Now you have an efficient way of raising your skill level. Yeah. Now we just finish the fight. The guy had one HP left. Yeah, like we be used to that too. Hey, Adelie. talking about that but come on they're the same as you right huh look the more times that you lose the sweeter the victory will taste trust me oh yeah hey you're right then i'll pray for them to win in their next match that's okay right you idiot coming from the victors that would just sound like you're trying to rub it in oh oops. <laughs> Sorry, I'll try to be more careful from now on. So, are you delighted with your maiden victory or what? Not bad at all. Congratulations, little Haseya. Man, you're persistent. I might have to start respecting you just for that. But remember, your rank is still dead last. You're nowhere close. So, hurry up and climb all the way up the rankings. And then you can come against me. This time, I'll be sure to love you to death. <laughs> Well, our maiden victory is done. We got some email though, so let's go ahead and log out. Something new on the official forum. The medic troop. They've apparently hired some new people on. And when you're going through regular dungeons, you'll occasionally see regular players near the, um, platforms and on occasion these will be just regular part regular players standing there they just happen to be taking a break and on occasion you'll see the medic troop it's nice when you run a up uh, run up with them because they will cure you to full and give you some boosts and then this here is just kind of a little more uh, 
fleshing out of the world, some guy named Soltaholic is creating a guild just for old people. And he's apparently got a decent number of people on. Not necessarily old people, I should say. Um, 35 to 62. Players must be older than 35. So it's a bunch of people of equal age that aren't kids. Now what do we got going here? I got something in the community forum. Crimson VS! Hey! Now let's see here. Talking about the ranking, there were two players playing Crimson VS. Which, Crimson VS is kind of a, a real neat card game they made for this. And so, uh, we're just talking a little bit here about the top two players and thinking who the next people are going to be. And apparently, the previous uh, two people were Gaspard and Niu Wang. So there's a whole lot of praise here going for them. Until Gaspard himself posts, talking a little bit about the uh, Niu Wang guy. Are you really the real Gaspard? Dude! Uh, apparently Gaspard is actually uh, pretty well known in the <laughs> Crimson VS community. I like that one. Because I like playing Crimson VS, so... Let's see here, we got a little bit about news, people talking about how newspapers are essentially going away, and then of course cocky leader starts yelling at Ohm Rice there and calling him Butt Rice, and the same thing happens that happens every time that happens. In rumors, what do we have in rumors? Triage? Project GU leader? What? Has Yada completely lost his mind? That can't be right at all. Triage isn't gonna show up to that, but... It is the Cathedral. We have the keywords for Hidden Forbidden Holy Ground now. We should at least investigate that. That isn't right at all, though. No way is that Yada. But... And we got some new uh, work in Apkalu here. A very odd drawing of Shino. Somebody drawing Endrance. That's actually a very nice drawing. For being Endrance. Okay, that is, um, let's see here, myself and Sakubo, two members of, um, so apparently Sakubo is a, a member of the gr guild Trifle? Trifle? I think it's Trifle. So, and then talking a little bit about Saku being uh, a bit of a fanatic for Master N there, and then apparently everyone talks with, uh, Interesting little faces. Ah, and then a picture of al Qaeda, who was the previous emperor of the Demon Palace before Endrance took over. And then, of course, the whole thing ends with, um... If I cheer on al Qaeda too much, I'll be slaughtered by diehard N fans. So I'm cheering for Master N, too. And then S comes in and insults the person over only talking about Master N in a postscript. Gee, I wonder who S is. A little bit more news here, nothing too special though. We have one here where there's apparently been a whole big dilemma over somebody stealing an item from somebody else in the 
game. Apparently trying to take him to court or something, or sue CC Corp or something, and CC Corp said, dude, not our problem. Um, the USA Times in danger because nobody buys the, um, paperback anymore. Or nobody buys the actual printed newspaper anymore, since they can just get it all online. And then, of course, we do have some new news. Or not new news, some new email. From Gaspard. Ah, just uh, just telling us about the Triedge post on the rumors board. We saw that one already, though. Well, not much else to do, though, but we should probably check that out. The Project GU leader? What? Has Yada completely lost his mind? I guess I better go to the Hulgrans Cathedral at Delta Hidden Forbidden Holy Ground. And off we go to see just what the heck's going on here. Ah, Hidden Forbidden Holy Ground. Perhaps the most iconic place in the GU universe. Ah, and this is also the place where Shino was killed. that you have fallen straight into my trap, Triedge. I have finally found you. Come and become bound as you deserve. Who... Who are you? Ha! You pathetic human beings are not worthy enough to know what my name is. just told me. Oh. Also, I'd better tell you that you've got the wrong guy. I am not Triedge. Hmm. <laughs> Please accept my apologies. I had truly thought that you, sir, were Triedge. So tell me, why are you looking for him? Hmm. Well, listen to this. I have a completely hypothetical story for you. Completely. Imagine, if you will, a graphic designer at a certain game company. And that that man possessed the greatest confidence in his graphical creations. He logged into his company's game to experience his creations in their native environment. Mm -hmm. But one day he saw something he couldn't believe right before his very eyes. His super amazing, ultra incredibly cool graphics that he slaved over for many waking hours had been all etched up with these hideous triangular monstrosities. What blasphemy, what lunacy! Now, having transformed into a deep, fueled by the fires of revenge, this hypothetical man used the forums to lay an impeccable trap, a foolproof plan for the culprit. Is that story really hypothetical? Of course it is. I said that it was, didn't I? Anyway, you're no match for Triage. Stop chasing him, for your own sake. Don't try to dissuade me! I'm never going to stop until I can find a way to trap him! So I guess you're looking for Triage too? Yeah. Hmm. Hey, could you please tell me if you find any more areas with Triage signs in them? Although you are dressed in some of the deepest black known to man, looking at you, I believe I do detect a little glimmer of justice deep inside your eyes. Very 
well, he of fair eyes. It would appear that you and I are partners in our quest to find Triad. Huh? I accept you as a fellow hunter of Triad and pledge to fight by your side until my life gives out. What? Well, whatever. So, what's this about you being Project GU's leader? So, you also wish to enter my guild, huh? Eh, it is not easy to join me, since the condition is you must be able to draw. After all, GU stands for Graphics Unbelievable. So, do you know anyone named Yada? No, who's that? Forget it. Never mind. Okay. Well then, I'm off to formulate another plan. May the stars shine down upon you until you arrive at the end of your journey. I'm off. I feel like I just shaved ten years off of my life. Guess I'll head back to town. Freaking Pyrrhus the Third, oh yeah. Oh, and as awesome as he is, I find I can actually only take him in small doses. So we probably won't be seeing as much of him as you'd think. Freaking Pyrrhus. Gaspar! <laughs> oh, it's you, Haseo! <laughs> um, what's up? What's up with you? You don't look so good. I... I'm fine. I'm pretty much the same as always. Alright then. 